Oh baby. <laughs> oh baby. 2.8 gigabytes later, I'm gonna get my hands on the best killer in Dead by Daylight. Papa himself. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> Dude, what is this first video? I'm like, <laughs> I've been playing the game for about uh, 10, 20 hours probably. I just bought the game and I played it all night the second I bought it because I was just in love with it. This might have been the next morning or something like that. Obviously, I only have three perks, so I, I don't know. It was probably around two or three hours of me playing the game at this point or maybe maybe even more than that maybe five or six i probably played about 10 or 12 games of dead by daylight cumulatively nice crouching along the map bro very good nice he's chasing someone he's pulled someone into the dream someone's in the dream right now so he's not he's not gonna I mean, this was old Freddy, so if someone's in the dream, he's chasing them because he can see them always. I don't know what I was thinking. Let me in. This is something you don't want to do when you play. Wow, look at these pixels. So what you don't want to do when you play Dead by Daylight is not look where you're going. We should analyze my first game of Dead by Daylight and look at all the things I do wrong in terms of the chase or whatever. Because the chase is the only skillful thing. Oh, nice hiding spot. Nice cell care spot, my dude. If you if he finds you, you're completely defenseless. Generally, generally wiser to stay near a safety rather than a hiding spot. It's a pretty good map. Can be good as long as I three gen. Three gen is very good on this map. What is with the auras? Oh no, they bugged the auras. Why are they so bad? Wait, are they supposed to look like that? They look really crap. I'm pretty sure these are bugged. They, feel, they look bugged. Um, it feels like two. Hey there. Alright. Wait, if you... Okay, so I can't cancel it, as far as I'm aware. Um... Close. Getting stacks. I'm gonna double back here. Smart. But I have her now. Ah, what happened? I hit mouse too. I respect this. Close. Ooh! All right. She ran right into it. What a fool. That was a pretty long chase, but um, I'm not a piece of the power yet, of course, so that's expected. Not quite sure how the charges work and how to go and loop someone on. It's not like the... Yeah, auras are bugged as heck right now. Unless this is the new aura system, which is dumb. I can pop this. Better run. I love you, Bubba. Pop this. So, yeah. There's pallet counterplay, not heavy loop counterplay. You can't just like put a chainsaw on the other end and then get to the pallet. I mean, I want to imagine you can, but that's that's not a reliable way to down someone. It's a way to get a pallet gone and shut down a loop, but. It's not a reliable way to get hit on someone. You can't mind game runs. That kind of crap. As far as this looks right now. So, not the best killer yet. Maybe we'll discover some secret to him. Not quite sure. Okay. Running. I think this is unwise. This guy's pretty smart for taking me this far. We're just going to get rid of this pallet. Doesn't have a window. Better throw this. I pressed mouse too. Is there like delay to it? Okay. 
He has to drag sh drop Shack Power right now. Good. Now you got that gen done. Unwise chase. Very unwise. I'm being very stupid for continuing to chase this person. That being said, I'm not going to leave him. Sometimes you just gotta leave someone. Oh, they didn't finish that gen. They finished another one. Hopefully they don't finish it by the time I get there. Good burst. Hi. I throw that. <gasps> ah! Whenever someone vaults a window, it looks like they're dropping a a firecracker. I get him to use this. I definitely do it. It's close. How'd you pick yourself up? Unbreakable, surely. Wow. I did not think that was that close. It didn't sound super close. That makes no sense to me. I thought that was like 80. It sounded like it was 80. I swear to God. When it's 100, it sounds... That felt misleading. To what I'm, I'm familiar about generator sounds. Um, we're gonna have to play Vicious here. I can't tell who's on gens. I thought I saw someone over here, but maybe not. Okay, there was. Good. There's no longer a pallet here. Hi. I gotta stop this. Steve's gonna run back. If he's a fool. Alright, we gotta claw it. Slug time. He did tap it. So he's going for the save. Oh, you should not go this way. Uh, yeah, you're a fool. There's no power here. Sprint burst. That sucks. Alright. They're gonna finish a gen. I gotta get a new pop. Oh my god, where are these hooks? These auras are messing me up, and that generator has me salty. Because that did not sound like it was 100. I thought, no, seriously, I didn't even think that it was that close. I didn't even, it did not even cross my mind that I needed to be proactive about kicking that. It sounded not close. He's going to take me to the school bus. I can't chase him. Yeah. There's stuff going on here. Is that a Kobe? No. This is Claudette. She doesn't have... Or she might have on Slinning, but I don't think so. Forget I have to press the button. Nice. Gotta take an M on there. I'm being stupid. Don't run past this nice camp the pallet. Good. I'll leave. Now that I know that sounds are dumb. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, the structure's dumb. Do you have a journal in? All the window, my good man. Guy's okay, slippery. But you flubbed it up. Good. Pallet stopping potential, but not pallet counterplay, unfortunately. Bubba is still bad. And I can't cancel that, so... Oh, right, it's Billy. I forgot. I forgot that uh, slight Billy. They told me that. Um, what gate are you going to? Forward. 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 Okay, let's try this now. Oh, I'm coming. 
I'm coming. No. You do have to be proactive about that, then. You have to be like... I, um... I extended it. Can you... I extended it. And... It, they didn't stack. I couldn't just, like, spam it for the maximum range. It, they didn't stack. From what it looked like. Oops. It, it was... It just used the last charge. I could have probably gotten him. If I didn't spam it. But I, I, didn't, I wasn't aware that that would happen. So that... That feels that feels bad. Um, or is it Bork? So I, I couldn't tell who was on barbecue brandy part. This team felt particularly sweaty for Jens. I, I, I was obviously weak with the power, but I got some pops in. Man, that one Steve Chase. I should not have followed him to that side of the map, especially. I mean, it's not like he was toxic, but he he seemed pretty strong with loops. Uh, I had I had power counter play, but ultimately I was just gonna get beaten by time because everyone's on the other side of the map doing gens. I have no pressure, even if I do eventually get him, which I probably would have. It wasn't worth it, and he had a lot of pals to work with. That was a really good RNG setup for him. Much like Auto Haven in general, even though that was the worst Auto Haven, it's still pretty good for RNG. I'm gonna play another because I'm not particularly satisfied with that one. From what I've seen, the charges aren't... You can't just go super far. It, you still have to be at a relatively small range for it to work. You don't get faster. It just extends it. it. It literally just makes it longer. And oftentimes, you'll need speed more than, more than you know, length. Um, so I'm, I'm curious about how add-on meta is going to happen here. What are his best, what are his worst. From what I've seen... I need it to be faster. I need more acceleration. I can't close the gap on pallets. I think movement speed or something like to that effect are gonna really make it make the dis the make the difference between getting a hit at a pallet and just breaking the pallet. Because he has great pallet stopping potential, but so does Clown. And Clown is the worst killer in Dead by Daylight now because he can't he can't get those hits before the pallet. He just eats pallets, and he's good at getting the pallets down, but. I mean, by that point, the gens are done, uh, if the team is smart. So that's why he's lower. Right now, I mean, he's better than he was because there's just adding stuff to him, basically. I don't know. He still seems pretty weak. Which is great because he can still be at the bottom. <sighs> if he's not great. Oh, if he's not great. That'll be so good. But we'll see. That Fangman was pretty stupid, but if people know that Bubba can just go further now, I feel like people will become more aware of, you know, maybe maybe I should drop this pal instead of acting as if it's old Bubba. Okay, you, will you will die. You will die. What? Okay, no. <laughs> I'm just getting spun. This is a video of me getting spun for for ten minutes. <laughs> this is really not going well. Stop I it. better get him. I better get him and camp him to. There we go. I got one. There's I bet they're gonna take hits and he's gonna get off and they're gonna go to the gate. Bill. You going up on the hill? Oh no. Right in front of what? Oh, DS. I forgot. <laughs> Old DS, man. We forget, we forget how recent that was, old DS. We forget how terrible that was relatively recently. Man, how quick we, how quick we forget Ironworks. Hang on. Cool. All right, um, honestly, this can be pretty good. What did they take, they bring? Just Salty Lips. This might be a team, because coordinated Salty Lips, it breeds coordination. All right. One and M1. Alright. Smart play. I wonder... No, that... She's just very dumb, I feel. Oh, yeah. New Bubba! New Bubba! God, this killer is going to be the best thing in this game. 
Once people realize how new bubble works, it can become the worst killer. If anyone runs up to the hook like that, just stand there for a little bit and make sure they're not behind you. Because if they pull someone off immediately, you're going to feel like the worst killer in this game. Collision. Buggy collision, I feel. Or maybe I took that corner a little bit too. Um. Alright. We're going to give you a little bit gritty here. Yeah. I got you. Yeah. So when um when someone baits a window, you get a lot more leverage with New Bubba. I'm seeing I'm seeing more um more freedom from mistakes. Because New Bubba, to do something like that, you had to be absolutely you had to read the survivor perfectly to know, okay, she's definitely gonna bait this and I'm definitely gonna go around this way. And you'd barely get him. It felt really good. I'm seeing a bit more leverage for uh, and leniency. Toward the weaker side of players. I need to break this pallet. Can't break it. Uh, I think I'm just going to go for this gen, to be honest. I don't really need to chase Fangman at all. Hmm. Buggy auras, man. Buggy auras. Alright. Nice, my dude. Now what? What will you do? Nothing. Nothing, bro. Nice tea bags. Call me in the morning. I should pop that gen. Actually, no, it's not even worth it. Alright, two hooks for two gens. Not looking good, but honestly, those two gens came out of nowhere, and I can't read ORS because the new ORS on the gens are. I can't even see them! I can. St okay, they're on that gen. I can barely even make out that gen in the distance. I feel like I'm a heavy disadvantage. Why am I even running Barbie? Like, I'm not salty, but it's just kind of like a goddamn it, Debs. Why did you have to screw up the ORS? Yeah, this is a coordinated team. I, I, I kind of gathered that. Uh, I'm just gonna go for Meg, I guess. Window. Nice fall. M1. We want her to go to Shack so we can make her use Shack. Oh, well, you. Nice. Oh, she's over here. It's a Meg. In a vault? No. You have Dead Hard. I have Enduring. Nice flashlight. You're wasting time. I'm coming for you, Meg. I can hear you, Meg. Let's go behind me for a second. Oh, we do have a pallet here, though. How about this, Meg? Come on! Ugh. So close. See, I mean, you don't you don't get a million bajillion meters of distance with that. That's something that... That's a misconception that people are just going to have to grip with for a little bit with this killer. Which kind of sucks. If that was a little bit more bigger, I could see him being a little bit better. But obviously, you need to kind of balance it a bit. Not um, make it so that every single person on the planet can master this killer. Again, the gen rush is strong. Uh, we're going to try to use pop here. I considered using it at the start, but... I have two survivors here. If I let them get to... Actually, they're sh I don't know why I didn't kick that gen, to be honest. And you're not smart. Oh! You're inside me! I knew she did the tech! I had a feeling. I heard the grass next to me. I was like, okay, she's doing the tech. Because she was looking at me. And most people, when you vault that window, they're thinking, okay, I can't make distance here. The tech's my only option. And then you just get it for free. And I didn't see her for a little bit. I was like, wait, where, where did she go? I heard her. Turns out I was inside her. And that gen's going to get completed. Um, I don't have her three gen, to be honest. Let's see if I can stop this. I don't think so. This is now buggy. Gen sounds are! What's up, team? You bubble them, Nia. It's the way of the road. Live with it. Bubba's the best killer! Haven't you heard? Nice blind. Nice blind. Where am I taking you? Um, sure I was gonna take a hit if I let her. Definitely could've wiggled off, but... I could. I didn't let her get in front, which is good. Uh, I think they touched this gen. We're gonna gotta be. We, yeah, we gotta be vicious about this. Two pops is gonna really annihilate progress. I don't care about Cheryl. Or that, that's Meg. I don't care about Meg. Cheryl's gonna save Nia. They're in a dead zone here, because this pallet's gone. 
So they gotta run past. Yeah, running past. We get Cheryl. Free down on Cheryl. Unless there's a pallet here. There's a pallet here. We got a free pallet. Alright. Now she's dead. Come on! No, Bubba, why you suck? Wow. Alright. Fangman's over here. Meg's still on the hunt, Jim. I don't know how I feel about that. Hey, team. Nice dead hard. Any of Is it worth it? But is it worth it, though? But is it worth it, though? Whoa, nice 360, my boy. Ah! Where is the hitboxes? God, I'm reliving my, my glory days as the worst killer in Dead by Daylight. Okay. Throw it. Are gonna DS? No. Okay, sure. Blunder on my part. Fuck you, Meg. Heavy blunder. They left. Alright. Making bad calls for gens. I can't... I got. I feel like that's a, a flaw in the sound. Like, I knew that gem was 99. I mean, obviously, checking the locker was really stupid. But at least we can pressure these two out and then I get a 2k. Which I'm relatively happy about. I'm over-ambitious. This killer is way misleading. You don't get a bunch of distance with the charges. Like it would like it would like you to believe. Oh. Uh -huh. Alright, 3k. Dead or not. So, hey, coordinated team. 3k. Technically, I lost because Nia got out, but whatever. Who's counting? Alright. I'm really upset that I didn't get this down here. You cannot be ambitious with this power. And I knew. I got gen speed. Honestly, I got beat by gen speed. I couldn't get to the gens in time. Coordinated team, so they, they knew to be vicious about the gens. Small PP build. Small PP build. Make fun of him. Yeah, this is definitely a coordinated team. Dead hard. DS. Dead hard. DS. Dead hard. DS. Probably dead hard. DS on this one. Absolutely, in fact. Iron will. Flashlight. Didn't get any use of it. Vigos. Yeah. They were they were too split up, and I couldn't um, I couldn't get pressure on them. For whatever reason. I had Fingman on the hook immediately, and they knew to just kind of sit there and do a gen. Maybe it's on me for not checking that gen that was close, because they did the gen that was close and then rescued her. And then I, I went to I went to chase like Fingman, I believe it was, and then I, we did the tech shenanigans, and then that gen got popped. There were two people on different gens though, which sucks. I would I would one hundred percent have all four survivors finish one gen immediately then have them all split up because now four different survivors are committed to four different gens and it doesn't ma matter how fast it'll go that survivor is going to be pressuring those gens and you can't be everywhere at once as killer which is now that these games are making me start to see scott Jones' point where you can't win every game getting 12 hooks i used to think oh he's being a bit unreasonable um i usually don't play in that way where you have to slug but no yeah these days, you kind of have to tunnel and slug a little bit, and I had no distance in between to get back to Fangman and pressure that hook. I only got, um, or, I don't know. I, I went all the way over here, and then they got rescued. I had to down her, hook her, and then go all the way back, and by that time, they'd split up. The pressure is gone. And then they can go save Fangman and then do all the gens they want while I'm chasing the people on the other side of the map. It was just like I had them in two different areas when I had to get everybody to come here. Especially in a post ruin Dead by Daylight, you can't be all over the map. There's just no time for it. What I should have done is popped Fangman's gen and not hook, not gone after her, or maybe just slug her. I should have gone back to the hook, or I should have just not gone to that gen. If I was presented the option, 
I get more pressure from just going back to the hook and downing people like that. Um, I should have gotten to that gen. I should have probably gone to that gen and just dealt with that one in general. Because then Feng Min, while I'm chasing the person that's close, Feng Min has to come and get um, get Cheryl off the hook. So now everyone's kind of over here except for one person that I'm not accounting for. But one person on gens is like nothing. So it's good for me. I have three people running around like headless chickens. I'm chasing whoever did that gen. Cheryl's on the hook and Feng Min's coming in. I down whoever I'm chasing and then I go after Feng Min, who's probably pulled off Cheryl at this point. I down Feng Min and then I slug Cheryl for DS and then I hook them both. Maybe the other person gets picked up by the other person, but now everyone is there. And my snowball can commence. And then I have a huge lead, whereas before it was just hook and hook. And that was it. There's no pressure. No gen stopping, nothing. So higher analysis is something that I'm, I'm gauging from Baba. But from what I've seen, this killer is definitely not good. Def I mean, he's definitely not great. He's not top tier, he's not even mid tier. I'd place him, I'd place him um, just above Legion, I think, in my tier list. Because um, you, you do not get enough distance or enough speed to actually do a lot with the power. It, it's, it is an upgrade from Bubba before, but that's not saying much. Um, overall, I'm happy with the power, to be honest. I mean, I'm not saying that, oh, I wish he was S tier or whatever. I say that as a meme, but I don't really care. Um, I it, Overall, I'm content with that this is an improvement in general, and I, I'd like to further understand this power and how it works and perfecting it a little bit because um, I'm very excited, honestly. But uh, we'll see how Bubba changes, in my opinion, changes on him as stuff goes on. Uh, yeah. Bye, guys.